layer some of your sounds. Let's say you want to layer a kick drum, or for this instance, I'll layer a clap for you. So I got this clap. Now let's say I go pick another clap. All right, there's another clap, right? Now I want this clap and this clap to both play together at the same time. I want to combine them. I want to layer them. In order to layer them, all you got to do, go back to your computer keyboard, press tab. Now if you look, let me go back. This is the first clap, this is the second clap. See the number one, the number two? You go to the back, there's number one, there's number two. There's two big circles, then you got another circle. Right under the two big circles, all you got to do is click with your mouse, and you can drag it over to this one. Now if you tab back over, these two are going to play together. Now they play together. Notice when I hit this one, both of them light up. They play together. So I'll add, matter of fact, I'll add another one. Let's say I want to add a snare to it. Let me find a snare. Alright, there's my snare. Alright, so I got a snare. Tab to the back. Now this time I'm going to go from number two and connect it over here to number three on the redrum. Now all three will play together. Notice when I hit this one, all three light up. That's how you layer your claps and snares. So I got two claps and a snare that play together. That can make your drums hit a lot harder. The effects and different things you can do, it'll really improve your drums if you start layering your stuff sometimes. Uh, so hopefully that'll help y'all out. That's about it. It's Trey Leon, CUC. We out.